Hi guys, Steve Towers here. Uh, the team asked me to put a few slides together around uh, South Africa's global leadership in the customer experience space. So that's precisely what I've done. So let me share the deck with you. It's half a dozen slides. Uh, but what it talks about is uh, how involved and engaged South Africa is from a, a customer experience point of view. So let's uh, share that. Make that bigger. So what I'm going to do is just give you a bit of context. Uh, if you've not come across the BP group, that's who I represent at the moment. Um, a little bit of context for you in the type of training that we do. And then we'll talk specifics about how that uh, plays out in terms of South Africa. So you see the size of it. We've been around as operating as a not-for-profit for, since 1992 and primarily do coaching and mentoring and consultancy services through a network of partners. And here, for instance, in South Africa, they include IQ Business, I guess, and uh, CX Group, I CX Group. And what those guys do, they're all trained and uh, operate licenses to deliver programs which involve training through certified process professional training, certified outside in master's training, and lastly, accredited customer experience uh, training. So we, we do that. There's a hundred and I think it's nearly 120,000 people qualified around the world now in, in our various different uh, modalities that, that process the customer experience and the, the outside in. And across the world, there's something like 80 odd coaches with over 300 mentors. Some of those people you can see on the right and some of you will recognize uh, some of those people as well. So if I move myself away from there for a moment. So you can see some of those people or your colleagues in this session um, as well as we speak. Now in terms of um, the, the numbers, if we attach some numbers to that for South Africa, uh, across CPPM, the COIM and the ACX master, the underpinning method there is the CM method, the customer experience management method, which came out into the public domain in 2006. And, and that method, as some of you know, is the amalgamation of next practice. It's the codification of the next practice of some of those leading organizations on the planet. Um, we've delivered the CM method in South Africa through various partners since 2005 across 324 organizations and 1,700 or so uh, people. And in 2016, we launched the Accredited Customer Experience Program, which is uh, as various accreditation authorities around the world through our, our partners, plus also through uh, business schools and that type of a thing. And there's four different levels to it. So there's the uh, professional level, the master's level, the champions level, as you can see, and subsequently the mentors level. And since 2016, 91 organizations have gone through that program with over 300 people becoming qualified. And in this last year alone, that's something like 82 people. Um, some of those people that we're talking about, the guys in the yellow boxes, some people are at the uh, AGM, so they are in a moment or two. Um, but in terms of South Africa's global leadership, a significant number of people who've come through the programme. I, I would say certainly in 2021, uh, you guys are up there like in the top three of the world in terms of people getting qualified in this. Uh, in the Masters a few months ago, uh, another bunch of people came through to qualify and, and learning the CM method gives us all the techniques and tools that we need to have to be able to do this stuff on a small scale to a completely enterprise wide scale. Now, amongst the masters, masters go on to become champions sometimes. And then in turn, those champions can then qualify as mentors. So these are a few of the mentors in uh, South Africa. And it's not an exhaustive list, this one. It's just the ones I could get the, uh, the, the pickies of. And again, some of those people who we partner with are also licensed to deliver the training. There's one individual I'd like to uh, draw attention to, though, who I think is he's the, a global leader in terms of what he's done in 2021. And that's, as you can see, is Edwin Delange at uh, Mercantile, right? And he is, those boxes, those red boxes on the bottom right there represent all the things he's gone through and qualified in, in the last 12 to 15 months. And uh, to acknowledge that the community, which is the BP group and our partners and all those people who are members who've qualified themselves, acknowledged Edwin as the change architect of the year um, some three or four weeks ago. So well done, Edwin. And from the point of view of everybody in this session, make no doubt about it, you are making uh, big, big waves on the world stage 
in terms of embracing the philosophy around customer experience, but not just the philosophy, being able to do it at a practical level with new organizations emerging who are, who are literally world leaders. So well done, guys. That's my piece. I'll see you later. Thanks very much.